क्वेश्चन सिक्सटीन ऑफ दिस एक्सरसाइज सेज इन एन इक्वलैट्रल ट्राइंगल प्रूव दैट थ्री टाइम्स द स्क्वेयर ऑफ वन साइड इज इक्वल टू फोर टाइम्स द स्क्वेयर ऑफ वन ऑफ इट्स ऑल्टीट्यूड्स सो लेट्स ड्रॉ अ फिगर टू हेल्प अ सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम सो हेयर इज एन इक्वलैट्रल ट्राइंगल ए बी सी दैट आई हैव ड्रॉन एंड लेट्स ऑल्सो ड्रॉ वन ऑल्टीट्यूड ऑफ दिस इक्वलैट्रल ट्राइंगल सो लेट्स ड्रॉ द ऑल्टीट्यूड फ्रॉम ए टू बी सी like this okay so let's take the foot of the perpendicular as d so ad is perpendicular to bc so we have to show that three times the square of one side so let's take that one side to be ab we can take any of the three sides but like let's take it to be ab uh, we have to show that three times ab square is equal to four times the square of one of its altitudes so let's take the altitude to be ad so 4 times the square of altitude would be 4 ad square so what we really have to show or to prove is that 3 times ab square is equal to 4 times ad square okay and because uh, triangle abc is an equilateral triangle the altitude ad will bisect the side bc and this means that bd will be half of bc so we'll make use of this thing in our proof bd will be half of bc so here's what we are going to do now we are going to apply the pythagoras theorem in triangle abd so abd i am going to highlight this triangle so we are going to apply the pythagoras theorem to this triangle because we want to relate uh, the side ab with the side with the altitude ad so let's do that now so in triangle abd by making use of the pythagoras theorem we will have ab square the square of the hypotenuse will be ad square the square of the altitude plus bd square okay now on the right side we write it as ad square plus bd square instead of bd let's write bd as half of bc because we saw earlier that bd is half of bc so we write this as half of bc whole square okay and now we can write this as ad square plus 1/4 of bc square and now let's make use of the fact that bc is equal to ab because the triangle abc is equilateral so instead of bc we are going to write ab so that we find a relationship between ab and ad okay so because bc is equal to ad we are now going to write a, uh, bc is equal to ab not ad we are now going to write ab instead of bc so this will give us ab square is equal to ad square plus 1/4 of ab square okay and now what should we do so we should take this term 1/4 of ab square and bring it to the left side subtract it from ab square so this will give us on the left side ab square minus 1/4 of ab square so that will be 3/4 of ab square on the left side and on the right side we will have ad square and now we can simply cross multiply this 4 on the right side and that will give us 3 times ab square is equal to 4 times ad square and this is what we had to prove three times the square of a side is equal to four times the square of an altitude so this completes our proof for question number 16 to learn more about how qmath can help you crack school and board exams explore qmath leap a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers